New at 5 o'clock after being in the hospital for several weeks, Sasha Fleischman, the gender-neutral teenager who was set ablaze while riding on an AC Transit bus, is back at school. Crown Force Hazik Madyun was there for the highly anticipated arrival. Sasha Fleischman returns to Maybeck High School in Berkeley. Here you see the 18-year-old Maybeck High senior being dropped off by the teen's mom, Debbie Fleischman, Monday afternoon. Sasha's very excited and feeling good, and that's what he's missed most is going to school. <laughs> being at school with his friends and going to classes with their friends. Here you see the gender-neutral Sasha wearing a black skirt with both legs bandaged, walking with a noticeable limp. The teen's mom says although the doctor gave Sasha the go-ahead to return to school after being hospitalized three weeks with second and third degree burns on the lower body, as a parent, she says she still has concerns about Sasha's strength holding up throughout the school day. Just stamina-wise, it's it, they've been through a tremendous, horrific thing, and it's it, the healing is still going to be going on for months. Back in early November, a 16-year-old Oakland High School student who's now in custody being charged with a hate crime set Sasha's skirt on fire after Sasha fell asleep riding home from school on an AC Transit bus, Sasha's preferred mode of getting to and from Maybeck. However, Mrs. Fleischman says there will be no bus riding, at least not for a while. Well, just because they're still really getting their legs back in terms of being able to walk and, and everything, that uh, it just doesn't make sense to be doing the bus right now so but eventually they they want to do it but they want to do it with friends as for Maybeck's plan for welcoming Sasha back the school's director put it this way so uh, we, we didn't really have anything planned uh, today uh, but uh, I, I know we're all thrilled to have Sasha back in Berkeley Hazik Madyun Cron 4 News